Welcome back to this playthrough for Wing Commander 4. And in the last mission, rescued a bunch of cats. So let's let's see where things go after going against my better judgment. Ah, Colonel. I suspect there's little need for an introduction. Greetings, Colonel. Never did I expect our paths to cross again. Small universe. My only regret is the sake of the stances that now bring us together. Since my personal surrender to you, Colonel, we can rather have tried to coexist peacefully with Terrans. Melek and his convoy are seeking safe passage back to their new homeland in Pasquale. We have been harassed by unknown forces for the past 48 hours. He brought us a copy of his ship's DR log, sir. That must be the weapon that was used back in Hell's Apart. My thoughts exactly. No. I've seen that before. So have I. When I first signed on with Confed, there was a rookie pilot on my ship. He's the only man I ever met who could do that trick. What was his name? He was transferred out real quick, disappeared into Confed Intelligence Ops. I can't remember his name, but he flew under the call sign of Seether. I could do a lookup in Confed Registry. That wouldn't do any good, Lieutenant. When Confed Intel wants you blanked, you're gone forever. I heard some word talk about a, a GE program, but never found out what it was. I'd just love to get that son of a bitch in my sights. No offense, Colonel, but uh, I wouldn't want to tangle with that guy. If he was that good then... Malik, I'd like to keep this recording. Uh, this, combined with the information that we've collected and decoded, will have to be enough. We've got less than a week before the assembly votes. Colonel, I want you to meet me back here in 10. It's time we made our move. Well, I have a feeling I'll do okay against either. There's nothing else. I've got invisibility code. I never would have believed it. All those years, all those missions. I devoted my life to knocking Karathi out of the sky. And now you're helping them get home. Don't take this the wrong way, sir. When I was growing up, I dreamt of nothing but fighting the Karathi. Now... I think Captain Eisen's making the right call here, sir. Do I look like I have all the answers? Eisen hasn't been wrong yet. Well, that seems very anticlimactic, so apparently that would raise his morale one and lower hers by one. Interesting. You finally took my advice about finding some place to get some rest. Yeah, it's the Ritz. Well, I'm not gonna put myself out too much on this Kilrothy foreign aid, that's for sure. What a waste. I fought those animals in the war. We'd all be a lot better off if their old kind was obliterated. Well, I mean, I helped out with that quite a bit, to be fair. He's missing the point. Look, right now the Kilrathi have the same enemy we do. Every time we want to fight for them, it's another battle won for the border worlds. Well, you just tell me where to shoot, 
and I'll pull the trigger. Thanks, Hawk. I knew I could count on you. Okay, so I think that's pretty much all the uh, conversations leading up to this mission. Oh, never mind. We'll be jumping to Pasquale soon. You should be safe there. As you know, Colonel, we killed Rafi dismantled all of our warships under the terms of our treaty with the Confederation. Thus, we have no means of defending ourselves. We'll get you home, Malik. But why is a new war waged upon us? My race no longer presents a threat. What happened to the Terran concept of absolution? Still alive. Most of us. Forgive me, Colonel. I am railing at the man who I should be thanking. I wish I could properly express my gratitude for your assistance here. Consider it payback. What is this word? Payback? Well, you may recall that a few years ago you had the chance to kill me and didn't. Mm -hmm. It's a decision I do not regret. Me either. Oh, there is one thing that you might be able to help us out on. Those two ships that attacked us, they came at us cloaked. Yeah. Well, you kill Rathi always had a speed when it came to cloaking. So if there's anyone with experience in your convoy, I got a chief mechanic that would love some advice. You're suggesting high-tech payback? Consider it done. Thanks, Malik. Okay. Now I should be able to do briefing. Or not. Captain Major! Here. Sir! Thank you. This is it, Colonel. I'm shipping out. Personal delivery? I think it's best that way. I haven't been in this man's Navy all these years without developing a few contacts in high places. When the boys at Confed see what I've got, they'll realize they have a few rats in the house. Can you trust him? What choice do I have? They have influence at the assembly. And they're the only way of uh, stopping the declaration of war. Captain. Transcom coming in, sir. Ah, Vice Admiral Wilther. You know who this is. He'll be the intrepid's acting captain in my absence. How do you do, Colonel? I must say, I've always wanted to meet you. Colonel, you all right? Oh, yes, I'm fine, Admiral. Wilford? Uh, weren't you with Confed, sir? Forty years of service. Came out to the border worlds to retire. But they convinced me to uh, come back to work. Uh, I know the feeling, sir. You'll be consulting with Admiral Wilford on mission assignments. He's constantly on the move. We're lucky to have him in our system. By the way, Admiral, what happened to that squad of Marines you were sending? Sidetrack. Operation in the Lennox system. You know how thin our resources are. They'll be there within the hour. Looking forward to working with you, Colonel. The Admiral's not much on goodbyes. Time I said mine. Talk to you later. <laughs> Who did that? <laughs> That's the most motion that that character shown this entire video or game. Good luck, sir. Same to you, Colonel. Same to you all.
Is that everything? Was there even a mission there? Okay. A little confused, but I guess I'm conducting the briefing now. Everybody here? Let's get to it. I want to start off by saying I'm going to do my best at running things in Captain Eisen's absence. Any of you have any questions or suggestions, I want you to come to me. We'll talk. Don't bitch and moan behind my back, but just remember, I have been given the job of making final decisions. Is that understood? Yes, sir. Certainly, Colonel. All right, let's get to it then. Got to move fast on this one, people. We've just entered the Pasquale system, and Melek's sources report that one of the Kilrathi planets, Pasquale 10, is under attack. Fighters with border worlds insignia. Of course, we all know that they are not being flown by border worlds pilots. Now, my guess is like everything else we've run into, it's the renegade faction of Confed behind this. Now, the hot spots are in these three nav points. I'll be taking two wingmen up. We're going to clear them out. Now, remember, they're in ships that look just like ours, so be alert. We don't want any friendly fire casualties here. Well, that's it then. Dismissed. I can't blame anybody but myself for this uh, mission, huh? Here we go. Bring me back a ship as clean as you did last time, and I'll show you what old pliers can do. All right, we'll stick with the banshee. Sad. All right. Anyway, I got. Yeah, maniac is good. Someone could shoot people down. Formation and open fire. Gonna give him some maniac magic. Break formation and open fire. These guys are history. Chalk up another for the maniac. Chalk up another for the maniac. Ooh, look what I see. Just 
say the word, Colonel. I can't wait. Break formation and open fire. You're gonna give them some maniac magic. Break formation and open fire. These guys are history. Knock ah! up another for the maniac. You forger world are low life. Formation and open fire. You're gonna give them some maniac magic. Break formation and open fire. These guys are history. Prepare to die. Chalk up another for the maniac. Why do I need to ask permission to land? Whatever. Need clearance. Hey! Word is traveling fast. I hear the Kilrathi down on Pasquale 10 have a new Terran hero, sir. Excellent. You are clear to land. Charge of this tugboat. I say I'm one land, you let me land. <laughs> So that's it for mission G2 in the uh, Pasquale system, I think they said. I think they had an E on the end there. Anyway, a uh, lot, um, lot of videos preceding this mission, but the mission itself was actually pretty straightforward. And I realized I forgot to turn on Anti Micro X. That's my uh, program I was using to basically set up the extra buttons on my control but fortunately I was able to adjust quickly enough to deploy my countermeasures from the keyboard so I didn't get blown up there but anyway that'll do it for this video thank you very much for watching and I'll see you all in the next one take care <laughs>